Good morning, everybody. Uh, excuse me. Just starting up a round of Pokemon Heart Gold. Nice. One of my personal favorites. Well, Soul Silver, to be more specific, but that's at that point it's just personal preference. Hot take on Pokemon. Heart Gold and Soul Silver are the best Pokemon games ever made. Just 
set to turn that light on. Excuse me. Alright, so where we left off, we were getting... You're getting effed in the A right here. You're not having a good time. So I don't remember having this many healing items when we last left off. My personal favorite is the OG black and white. Yeah. Yeah, the, it's between those two for me, really. If it wasn't for the fact that black 2 and white 2 were also really good, then, you know, if they were both, like, I don't know, if you could combine both experiences of both the original Black and White and Black 2 and White 2, it would just, like, then, then you'd have best Pokemon game for me. But what takes it away for Heart Gold and Soul Silver is mostly, like, the UI of it, because there's, it's just so, so helpful in almost every aspect. There's a few things like box stuff that they fixed in later ones, but I think the whole like, especially when it comes to touchscreen uh, DS Pokemon games, I feel like the way that they just set it up so that the entire game can be played like either with button controls or with touchscreen controls and you know, just your left hand. I appreciate it. I never use like exclusively touchscreen controls, but it was super nice, and it makes speedruns of it interesting, especially if you're into menuing, like me, because because I'm weird like that. Lewis's memo two: First, Castell and buried in Las Plagas deep underground between below the castle to hide their very existence, uh, but. When Salazar realized the Las Plagas, no one released the Las Plagas, no one thought he could bring them back to life. Because when Salazar found them, they were all just fossilized remains. I'm letting you, Danny, or Ri, or Chat pick, pick my second Pokemon. Ooh. Hmm. The tough call. I would have to. I would have to look at a, uh, I would have to look at a thing, a, a, a Pokedex list. I personally recommend Bug-type Pokemon, especially for that game. Bug-types can be very useful. Everyone knew that the parasitic organisms could not survive without hosts. That they, couldn't that they couldn't sustain life on their own. But when Salazar and his men excavated the remains, it almost appeared as if the Las Plagas were just waiting to be discovered so that they could resurrect. Several years later, unexplained convulsions started occurring among the villagers who had helped with the excavation of the Las Plagas. Then one day, all of a sudden, these villagers turned into violent savages. Yeah, I suppose that's pertinent information, Chris. Like, what's, what was your first Pokemon? What did you start with? Did you go with Chikorita? Did you go with uh, Cinequil? Or, you know, my personal favorite Totodile? I have a hard time picking favorites for that generation, too. I just like all of them. They later found out it was caused by Las Plagas. Although they appeared fossilized, they were able to survive the long years by lying in a dormant state at the cellular level, remaining in a spore-like form. Apparently during the excavation, the villagers inhaled the spores and within their bodies the parasites became active again. This is how the Las Plagas were resurrected. Even as I'm writing, the excavation of the Las Plagas continues. Thanks for that, John Moy. Much appreciated. Thanks for the host.
I'm sorry. I'm sorry, John. I'm not in the mood for singing today. But I appreciate it. You are who I'm looking for. How are you doing today, John? Apparently during the excavation, the villagers inhaled the... Oh yeah, we already read that. God only knows how many of these Plagas have been resurrected. Not to mention the countless numbers of Ganados that have been created. Their inhumane activity must be put to an end. If they are not stopped, people around the world would turn into victims at this crazy cult organization. That sounds bad. Yeah, I was trying to sing a song, but I'm doing okay. <laughs> yeah, my apologies, friend, but the beginning of the stream is not always, uh, I don't know, I, I, I need time to get into the, into the mood of it. I'm sure if you caught me at a good time, I would probably, I would probably sing for you. That being said, if we ever play Metal Gear Solid 3, I will sing Snake Eater all the way through that game. That is my promise to you. Oh yeah, we we went... That's what happened. We, we, we blew up the dude. Of course, I understand. Never played Metal Gear? It's, um... Is that a sin? Um, I don't like saying things are a sin so long as you are aware of it and, you know, may one day actually play it. Or, you know, I might play it on stream. I have to, I have to figure out how to, how to capture my PS3 first, but when I, when I do that, I can guarantee, you can bet your bottom dollar that there will be Metal Gear Solid on this stream. Ow. Should probably heal first. It does have range. That was kind of the, the selling point of it. It was like, this this shotgun has longer range. But that sounds like a good idea. I'm going to take that shotgun. There are a lot of people around here. dynamite in it. about this game, I think this is the most creepy Resi game out of the series. I have I have heard conflicting arguments about that. Like I've seen a lot of people say that this is when the when the Resident Evil series started to get into like more of the uh, more of the actiony type stuff. Instead of uh, instead of it being mostly like survival horror, I could kind of see that, having not played any other Resident Evil games myself.
very full ammo. The first Resident game is a masterpiece. Yeah, like... I don't even know how, like I don't know how to respond to that honestly just because I have no opinion of any of the other games. Mostly just what I've heard from other people and like I have heard a lot of people uh what console am I playing on? This is on a, this is a Steam version. So this is on PC. I'm also using an Xbox One controller. I would like to. I'm definitely enjoying this one. It's brought a few people to the stream. It just makes me sad because I don't know if my computer can really handle uh, there isn't an Evil 2 remake. It's not so much whether or not I can handle it, more so whether or not I can play it while I'm streaming. Just because I did Dark Souls 3 on stream and that was kind of a pain. Same with uh, Hat and Tie -in. And this game, you know, this game is from... I don't know how long ago. Like 14 years ago, so... It was quite the pain. Yeah, my computer is good for the most part, but I'm still trying to figure out some stuff when it comes to, like, streaming PC games. Oh, we got one of these guys again. I do not know. I'm a. I'm at least a little bit more conscious of that. It's not always at the highest setting. I would like to one day be able to have a computer that's always at the highest setting. This game is at the highest setting, but. I mean, the highest setting for Resident Evil 4 is not all that taxing. Sure, uh, what you're referring to there to be quite honest oh Salazar um, where did he go I mean, I honestly, I had honestly forgotten about him. Uh, let's... Where did he go? The last time I remember seeing him, he like, fucked with us with one of those weird puzzle things. Oh, 
Oh yeah, he... We were, uh, like, we chased him down into a church, and then he just, like, opened up a trap door and, that we fell into, and, you know. Now we're down into this sewer mine thing. I guess it's a mine. Just collections of fossils. Because that's how fossils work. Didn't he run out the door when the ceiling was falling? I'm not too sure. It's been like... It's been like 20 hours, man. Can't expect me to remember that stuff. <laughs> Sorry, man. I just I play so many games that it's it eventually gets to a point that it's hard to remember. It's hard to remember every little detail. <laughs> that being said, like when a game like really captivates me, then I'm very interested in every detail. back out of that, is he? Come on. It's only so much suspension of disbelief that I can take. Oh good, it's closed. Uh oh. Can't you what? Oh. Can't use it again. This is unfortunate. At least I got one out of it. That didn't do very much damage. Uh, we're gonna equip this. Use this. Uh oh. What 
Throw a grenade. Will that work? Kinda worked. It did something. That didn't do anything. That's for, that's for sure. Flash screen. something. That's how directions work, but okay. Hoping it would be like an animation thing. Like if I shot him at the right time, it didn't even matter which weapon it was. Apparently not. Well, maybe. Might be part of it. So I think I might be better off just reloading a save.
Yeah. Uh, load game. I'm just not sure, like... Like, I think I was starting to get it, it's just... There's a lot of damage you gotta output. Welcome. Got some rare and I just wasn't doing it. Sale, stranger. What are you buying? Come back any time. I don't have any money, so can't buy anything. But I, I want to just like I'd rather just try and see if I can uh, get both of them in that hole at once. More specifically, by using the uh, the flash grenade to stop them. Excuse me, fellas. Need to get to the circuit breaker. I do like it when they just take care of themselves like that. Ow. Thought it was going in a different direction. But I guess not. Oh. That's an insta-kill. <coughs> Be more careful around the chainsaw guy. Please don't blow up near me. Oh, 
flash grenade. We're gonna need that. That's definitely something that's hard to get used to. Blowing someone's head off and not having that be the end of them. Most games that's that that's the point when people die. Oh sorry. So I wasn't a chainsaw. Resident Evil 4 is supposedly the best game in the series with Resident 1 coming in second and 7 and 3rd. Where'd you get that information from? Just, just, just curious. Oh, hey, Norn. Yeah, I, I couldn't really figure out anything else to do today. So I just figured I'd keep going at this. I had to go with my... F uh, my first Pokemon is Cyndaquil. And I figured out my team, I just need an HM slave. Oh, you can't really go wrong with a uh, with a centret slash ferret. I believe ferret can learn rock smash. Uh, can learn strength. Can learn. It's got to be a couple more. PC Gamer Magazine. Most Pokemon, it's a it's a very popular RPG. Very popular. See ya. Pokemon is an RPG that involves being sarcastic. Hey, I never know, man. You be careful with that sarcasm. I might have to learn not to trust you. I'm not a fan, personally. That's fair. I believe we had a similar conversation in an earlier stream with some other people. But don't worry about it. I am very big into Pokemon, so... But I understand there are a lot of people that are not. And that's okay. I'm just joking, John. I'm just gonna have to learn how to deal with your sarcasm a little bit more, so... You know. Grew up with Yu-Gi-Oh! I was kinda in the middle, but... I always played the Pokemon games. Never really got away from that. I still play Pokemon on a regular basis. Good. 
sarcasm is not welcome here. As we've established. I don't know if you could sense my sarcasm, but... I still hit both of them. Well, we still only got one, but... I was being sarcastic, Reed. See, if sarcasm's not welcome here, then... then then we then we lose re and that's a problem oh fuck rip <laughs> Yeah, that's what I have to deal with on a regular basis. Come on, Leon, run faster! Was that... That was only one. Man. Don't tell me the game forces it to always be only one. I was certain both of them were on there. Yeah, that's gotta be the case. So Chris, what's your what's your what's your final decision on your team for Heart Gold? Don't leave me in the suspense here. Excuse me. I need to know. You got Cyndaquil.
Mewtwo, Kyogre, Ho, Latios, and maybe Pidgeot. <laughs> maybe. But you already got a flying kite. This guy's committed to the big guns over here. Way, waste of ammo here. Casual jog away from danger. That's how we do it around here. We take our time. Also, these El Gigantes must be made of, like, paper or something, because... You would expect that to do a lot more damage. Magnum comes in handy. Smoke grenades and explosives. I do not. I did. I got rid of it. Figured keeping the Magnum wasn't worth it, but maybe it was. At this point, I don't think I'm doing so bad. I didn't think I was doing so bad. Oh yeah, right. I was, there's like that quick time event. That's not really a... It's not a guaranteed kill, but that's that's definitely probably going to do more damage than what I was doing. Closer. Oh. Thought he was stuck or something. I thought, but I was wrong. There we go. That's what you mean. You can climb through the cut. That, that hoot hoot's not, uh, not doing too well, eh? It's a good thing you caught him. Or he would've been screwed.
I should be doing a better job of trying to avoid some of these attacks. second there I thought he wasn't dead he's dead we did it we had a bunch of money for it hey we did it together guys through the power of friendship the power of friendship and teenage angst. Well, I guess leftover teenage angst well into adulthood when when you should be over these kinds of things. Too old for teenage angst. Not my fault. Angst, it's like, it, it's like that, like, general angriness and, like, discontent that people have towards things. It's kind of a hard thing to describe. These things are not very, uh... Not very strong. At least compared to the other ones. Yeah. Yeah, that's probably a good way to put it. Sort of like when being like... Angry and upset about things is starts to become like part of your character uh, and they just kind of like it's a general stereotype that teenagers are just always discontent with things they're always upset Excuse me. I'm the one that's supposed to be doing the kicking around right here. Ow.
I don't know if that guy's gonna do anything. Oh, he he's he's figured it out. Kind of. Can't quite figure out what uh, what plane he wants to be on there. Anyway. The two lights shall shine light on a new path. Okay. lights will, will light the lights along my light path. You yeah, have dirty water. I didn't need that, but I got the extra room. There's an evil four enemy AI, everybody. Beautiful. If you, I guess if you shoot them in the air, they just immediately die. I'm okay with that. Press. Oops. That's what I get for uh, for not pausing when I go and make sure that my webcam's centered properly. I just want to make sure you guys can see my beautiful face. Reloading, not fair. 
can't kick while I'm reloading. Excuse me. They heard me talking about them. They heard me tripping their AI. They need revenge. worried there. I thought he sent me sent me off the edge or something. Good, that guy dropped a red herb. Let's try this again. I'm glad they die in one hit while they're in the air. It's super convenient. Until they're not in the air. Then it's not very convenient. Okay, see ya. My guy was just like, nope. I'm done. I ain't busting my ass for the man no more. Excuse me. Oh god. It's a lever here. 
sure. Place seems like it's full of traps. I'll just pull a random lever then. I guess we're not exploring the rest of that room. Sorry, I don't see coffins and just immediately think, oh, it looks like there's nothing in here. Oh. Worth the look. I don't see coffins and immediately think elevator. Not my, uh, not my first thought. Letter from Ada. Once a Plaga egg hatches, it's nearly impossible to remove it from the body. But if it's before it hatches, then it can be neutralized by medication. If it does hatch, you might be able to get out of it, get it out by surgery before it turns into an adult. But it won't be easy. There's a high chance you won't survive the operation. As far as I know, the girl was injected with the egg before you. Her time is ticking. You should prepare yourself for the worst case scenario. Welcome. Got some rare things on sale, stranger. What are you buying? Please, if something happens to Ashley, please, like, do not tell me. I would prefer to not know. I see you have an eye. By you. <laughs> Thank you. Also, nobody said anything in chat for a while. I'd be lying if I said I wasn't a little bit, you know, concerned, but maybe it's fine. Maybe I'm just. Quiet evening, that's fine. <laughs> okay. At least I know my chat's working. Uh, that's, what are you buying? That's my real concern. I'm okay with quiet evenings if people want to sit back and just, just watch. It's just like... When it gets real quiet for a long buying? time. What are you selling? I know you're not following. You don't have to follow. Nobody really has to follow. Is that all? <laughs> Thank you. I know a lot of Is people <laughs> like to you. just put this on in the background, and I'm perfectly okay with that. If I wasn't okay with that, I feel like I'd be quite the hypocrite, considering I do it to other streams all the time. Looks good. Let's move on. That's what I do most of your streams, and every once in a while, check up on the game or the occasional message. That's cool, yeah. 
Like, I definitely appreciate ha having you here, Chris. I appreciate you coming in and, like, giving me little updates on, like, what you're doing as well. Everybody here is welcome to share. Anything they, they want to share. I didn't think my knife was... That strong, but... Apparently my knife now lights people on fire. Or maybe these guys just... Are prone to lighting on fire. Love the background noise. Yeah, like, like I tend to put streams on in the background. Like if I take a nap in the afternoon or something. I just, I tend to have to, uh, oh, they spotted me. Kind of have to, like, vet the streams that I do put on in the background when I'm trying to sleep. Just because, you know, you don't really want, like, somebody that's going to start shouting in the background while you're trying to sleep. That's a big reason why I don't really like watching people play Fortnite on Twitch, is because I don't like sitting there with like background noise going on and then just suddenly like, you know, some dude just rages out of your speakers. Out pretty well. Nope, never mind. I thought it worked pretty well. It did not. That's a lie. It did work pretty well, and then. Then I was being an idiot. Like, in the back of my head, I'm just sitting there thinking, like, I'm gonna die. I am going to die in this situation if I don't switch my shotgun and shoot him, but... It just doesn't click. Excuse me. This is my platform. That's the guy with the hatchet. head grew weird tentacle monsters this time. One of the few situations in which I'm okay with that.
You know, most times I'm okay with the tentacles, but but Resident Evil, Resident Evil's not one of those times. I'm sorry, what? It's locked. Offer of sacrifice to the lion. Hmm. If I were gonna give a sacrifice to a lion. What would I sacrifice? Shotgun shells. Oh. And a crank. I think Ashley's better at turning cranks than Leon. IMO. Can I, like, can I read this, or... Of a headrest, the offering of the lion. Okay. Sounds good. Nope, can't knife any of that. Oh, there's another box. Nothing in the box. sound was. Uh-oh. Come here, Chainsaw Boy. I'm ready for you. Chainsaw boy. Just hanging out in the window. Not sure if he can actually like get out here. Kinda there. Oh hello. I didn't see you there. And he's dead. Anybody else? That guy. That guy over here doesn't really seem too concerned. Back up. Knock him back down. Oh, he 
things back up again. This guy's skull must be made of titanium or something. Either that or he's wearing the, uh... Wearing the sack from, from Dark Souls. That thing is way too overpowered. Oh, well, music stopped. I guess it's dead now. Going to... Can I disarm these at all? Like... If I shoot the bear trap. Okay, shooting the bear trap seems to work. I don't know if there's a better way to deal with bear traps, but... Sir. Good thing I've got a shotgun shell with your name on it. And a knife. Oh, hello. Oh. Didn't see you there, sir. I'll get to you. shot. That was good. Where did the rest of those people even come from? Did they just spawn in when I went down? Went down into that room? One can only assume. Is this a, no, this is a different room. Oh god, come on. There's a bunch of money in here. Them spiders are indeed creepy.
That's cool, don't worry about it. You don't need to apologize for not saying anything. Just having you here is, uh... Having you here is good enough for me. Yeah, like, I'm always, uh... Notorious lurker in other people's chats, so I don't mind people lurking around here. Even when I do participate, I always have a I always have a hard time like trying to come up with like meaningful things to say. It always feels so forced half the time. But I just I don't end up saying anything. So usually I'll like I'll say hey in somebody's chat just to be like yeah hey like I'm here you know I'm watching nice to see you thanks for streaming and then I like won't say anything for like a couple hours and like I'll, I'll just be like paying attention to the stream something witty comes to mind and I'll just be like oh I'll, I'll post that in the chat I don't know, maybe it's just my mindset, because I grew up with, uh... I grew up with, uh, not just, um... Why does this place look very, uh... familiar? You know, just like, I'll just come up with something to say, and say it. Hmm. It looks like my insides. Oof. You might want to get that checked out, dude. Shotgun seem to work a lot better for that. See, I think I might have seen, like, part of a speed run for this game. So, like, this is kind of the only part of the game that I actually think I know. I'm real glad that she, uh, that she fell out of the cart there. So that could have been a bad time. Big oof indeed. dodge. See, I was, it was, the thought was just crossing my mind, like, I thought there was more to this. Like, I feel like they're gonna throw something at me. Like, I certainly remember something like that. Oh. Sorry guys, I just gotta reload first. Oh. Oh. It's like dodge, dodge what? Oh shit. Right. There are things to dodge. Like planks of wood. Uh oh. 
Oh, come on. I thought I was... I thought I was jumping the thing. He didn't jump the thing. Other than the insta-death, that, that, that segment doesn't seem so bad, though. So we'll see. Since, you know, every time I seem to say something like that... Things tend to change very quickly. Should probably reload this first. Picked the wrong minecart to jump in, boy. Ow. You're still alive. Ow. I got a knife too, you know. Don't make me use it. Come to our first dodge. Nice dodge. Damn it. Yes, take the shotgun shells. We're gonna need them. In about half a second. for knife just, just shoot so many items like goddamn that's what got me last time was too many items in the way ow should probably heal while I have the time somebody in in the cart with me but I guess not uh oh get out do not want to share the cart with you oh fuck well at least my reload still counted This is my favorite roller coaster. Well, how's it going, Fallen? Glad I got that quick time event. What? Just getting home. That's not too bad. Re and I went grocery shopping before before the stream, so it's a little worried I might might be late starting, but but we managed to we managed to start on time.
Yeah, I was thinking the same thing as Norn. Like, usually you're, uh... Usually you're here, but I guess you're... I mean, you're allowed to be busy, so... Oh no, Monday is, uh... Monday is my break day. Wolf's the one who takes breaks on Sundays. Taking a walk, thinking about life, oh yeah. I don't do that as much as I used to. I used to do that a lot when I was when I was a teenager. Empty, oh shit. I think I might have leaned on my shotgun a little bit too much in in this run. Okay, we got other weapons. That's cool. Oh, fuck. How's your walk falling? Raccoon Man four five seven, how's it going? I personally love raccoons. I mean, they can be they can be nasty little biters when you're you know trying to keep them out of your trash, but raccoons are sexy indeed. Jesus, good. How's it going, Colin? I am, uh, I guess I can pause here. Raccoon Man, thank you. Thanks for the follow, dude. Yeah, I used to have a... I used to have a friend whose, uh, his grandparents lived out in the, out in the forest. And they used to raise raccoons on a regular basis. It wasn't like completely out in the middle of nowhere, but they they lived like just outside of a out of a small town. Doing good. That's good to hear, Raccoon Man. Can I have your raccoon? If I had one, I would say no because you know I'm not just gonna. I wouldn't just give animals away to random people on the internet. That sounds like a bad idea. <laughs> I know John Moy. I mean, he uh, he came by the stream yesterday. I don't know if I know this guy in real life. It didn't seem like it though. I think he. I think he's a. Uh, so I do know who you're talking about. He's. He started following the stream yesterday, so. I'm assuming you know him, Raccoon Man. Uh oh. No 
know him very well. Ooh. Well, I'm glad I just, you know, clipped through that. Well, I won't ask about the details of how you know him, Raccoon. But glad to have you here. Inside of him. I'm pushing X. Come on, game. No comment. Just as long as you're inside of them consensually. We like to uh, we like to practice proper consent around here. I'm his soul. Oh. His eyes, ears, and mouth. is so laggy I can't even watch properly. Hmm. Get to my level. Is the stream laggy for anybody else? Like... Like, I'm not dropping frames, my bits are fine, but I know my, uh, my camera was looking a little choppy earlier. I don't know, it seems fine on my preview. Looks like it's, looks like it's alright. I'm just kind of waving my hands because it's very tiny, so, like, the only thing I can really see is, like, me waving my hands. I like dry shampoo. That's, uh, I prefer, uh... I don't really know what constitutes as dry shampoo, to be honest. I use head and shoulders mostly. Keep that dandruff away. I imagine it is fine, so long as it's good in your imagination falling. Now that AGDQ is over, I might be a little bit more lucky and get some quality options, so... I found out a little bit more information about how quality options, excuse me, work on, work on Twitch. I just saved. Um, apparently, so partners are guaranteed to have quality options available on their stream, obviously, since they're partners. And then affiliates are, um, like, they only get it when it's available. But that's dependent, like, well, affiliates and just regular streamers, they only get it when, uh, what's Sean Moy like in the stream? He seems like a good guy. I mean, he only, uh, he only came by yesterday. So I, I haven't gotten the chance to know him very well, but he seems very nice. Or a little random. Yeah, so, like, it's by priority. So, like, affiliates have higher priority than non-affiliates, but it's still not guaranteed for them. So, 
like I would imagine with something like AGDQ going on, they were probably, oh, this is uh, interesting. Like with something like AGDQ going on, it's probably very unlikely that affiliates are going to be getting getting quality options. Drop some prayers to the Emperor to make that day come. Why do more people just keep showing up on these hands? Nope. Probably should have been. someone named Raccoon Man was here, John. That wouldn't happen to be... That wouldn't happen to be you, would it? I wasn't gonna try and call you out. If it was you using an alternate account, but... There was indeed someone here. But yeah, Raccoon Man just kind of said some, it wasn't me at all, just trying an extra follower. Oh, that, that that's fine. He mostly just said some weird things asked what you were like in the stream and I just said you know you came by yesterday so I haven't really gotten the chance to know you very well but you seem like a very nice person very open and honest and Oh no, it wasn't that bad. The ultimate bread. How many stacks you got now, Colin? Hey John, I'm just gonna be... I'm gonna be real with you, like... I mean, I, like, that was... Like, you, you just gotta be yourself around here. You don't have to be so, like, apologetic and such. You know, I appreciate having you, and, like... I'm not gonna tell you no, don't use an alt alternate account or anything. You can do what you want, really. 
but uh, you know, like just. Come on, hang out. I don't mind you being weird or anything. Just you know, so long as you're, as long as you're having fun and you're not making anybody else uncomfortable. You're always helping. welcome here, John Moy. it here that's good I mean I only really say that because like I remember being a teenager Ooh, uh oh sprintly on but like I remember being a teenager and I I was very nervous about things when it when it came to things online and such so I would do stuff like make alternate accounts and like try to pretend to be other people Just to see if, like... I don't really know why you did that. I'm not gonna fault you for it. You, you can do what you want, really. So nice you could join us, Mr. I was gonna tell you eventually. Well, you did tell me eventually. <laughs> the sacred rite that's about to begin at this tower shall endow the girl with magnificent power. She will join us. Become one of us. This is no ritual. It's terrorism. Isn't that a popular word these days? Not to worry. We've prepared a special ritual for you. 13 stacks and 19 bread. Nice. <laughs> Epic indeed. I deserve an extra follower. I appreciate that. I appreciate the thought, but at the same time, like, I don't expect my viewers to go out of the way and, like, make alternate accounts or, you know, go through the effort of, like, like, I don't know how much YouTube you watch, but back in the day it used to be a very common thing where, like, people would, like, you only made ad revenue if people clicked on, uh, the ads. So people very specifically, like, went out of their way to, like, click on ads that they weren't interested in just to make sure that their followers got the, uh, like, got that ad revenue for it. Ad revenue since changed, but, like, uh, you know, like, you don't have to go out and do that. Like, there are better ways to, to show that, uh, you know, you support somebody. I don't always need, like, money or more numbers to know that you're gonna be... that you support the stream and that you want to be here. That being said, that's just an example. I'm not trying to give you a hard time, John. And, like, if you've already got the account, then, you know, there's no harm in logging on to that, pushing the follow button and whatever. Especially, like, right now, like, Every follower counts to me, so my stream keeps skipping because of the delay. Mm. I'm not sure. Re's usually my uh, my my benchmark when it comes to quality of the stream, and she hasn't really said anything. But at the same time, she's not uh, she's not really watching as much as you guys are. questions about shampoo.
It's a lift. Go up. I haven't noticed any audio skipping at least, but I haven't been watching the video. See, like, I've only dropped 60 frames in the two hours that we've been streaming, so... Hello. So it doesn't seem like it's it's anything on my end. It's also Sunday. Twitch tends to have conniptions on Sundays. How long do you plan on streaming for? Until at least 10 Eastern, so a couple more hours. Once I get to like the next relatively safe point, I'm gonna take a quick break, grab another beer for myself, and you know. Stretch and all those good things. But it should be live for a little bit longer. A little while yet. Okay, we're gonna need... We need to heal... Where we lose our head... Okay, we're good. I think my knife has a maximum of three, three hits per swing. Oh, that's an arrow. So is anybody doing anything interesting this week at all? Any good plans? Any hobbies? I can tell you I'll mostly be streaming. Streaming and looking for jobs. I have school, I have no hobbies. Video games count as a hobby. job appointments that's that's good fallen I'm, I'm glad to hear that you're uh, making some headway on finding a job how long did he say I have it muted because I have friends over but I'm still watching uh, we're I, I'm gonna be live for another at least two hours or so maybe a little longer since it is Sunday I have a hobby video games that's about all I had when I was when I was 16. Video games and bass guitar. And now I'm here. But yeah, I'll mostly be uh, streaming on my regular schedule for the next week. Well, I say regular, but the schedule that is currently posted. Looks like we might got a uh, boss fight coming up, so... Welcome! Got some rare things on sale, stranger. 
What are you buying? RPG. That might be that might be a good idea, Fallen. You might be on to something there. What are you buying? I don't know what boss this is, but Stranger. Uh oh. I have to find some room for it first. My ass can be an RPG when it wants to be. I hear that. Maybe I don't want to hear it, maybe. Maybe it's Salazar? I can only assume it's Salazar. That being said, still... Still would like to avoid spoilers. If it is or is not, and you are aware, do not tell me. But just so Fallen has a reference, we did just finish, uh... Avoiding a giant statue of Salazar and then going up a giant lift. No spoilers. Yes, please. Thanks, guys. <laughs> Thank you. Eh, he doesn't have any first aid what sprays. Are you Not aware, just guessing. That's fine, just, you know, like, be aware in your guesses, like. Oh, he's got. Oh wait, no. This is this is the sell menu. Do not sell our green herbs. How do you get mods? Not that it's important. Do you mean like mods on the channel or mods in 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 the game? Is that all? <laughs> Thank you. Mods for the channel. Um. What are you ba like basically I can just you know decide like it, it you know I just attribute I can pick someone and decide that they're a mod and it gives them some extra abilities to do things right now the only uh, the only person I have as a mod is Re and I have no intentions of making anybody else mod right now because I think between the two of us, we should be fine, and we haven't had any issues with uh, with chat. What are you buying? That being said, please don't, please Is don't cause me stranger? issues in the chat. I'm not inviting that. Is that all? <laughs> Is that? <laughs> Thank you. What are you buying? Not enough cash, stranger. Is that all? <laughs> Thank you. What are you buying? Yeah, I haven't had to ban anybody yet, but I'm not looking forward to the day when I eventually have to. And I'm hoping it won't be anybody that's currently watching right now because I'm a mod on YouTube channel with uh, 70,000 subs. <laughs> oh wait, what did I do? Sorry, no. Don't worry, John, you're safe. For now, at least. I'll mind my manners. You're the one I'm really worried about falling. Gotta watch out for you. If you couldn't detect my sarcasm, that was sarcasm. I won't do anything, I'm not that type of guy. Well, the best thing that you can do is uh, is show it to me instead of instead of telling me. I knew it. I was on the blacklist. You're on my watch list, Fallen. I'm keeping my eye on you. Anyway, we're gonna jump to an intermission real quick. And I gotta put on some music so you don't have to listen to, uh... So you don't have to listen to people whispering in Spanish. While I go and do my stretches. 
gotta play that tune again. You guys weren't around for the loading screen, so. No, not that one. We want this one. Yeah. That's the tune we want. Where are you? I mean, you're definitely on my good list for now. I'm pretty sure everybody that's come by has remained on my good list. Unfortunately, I'm used to hearing people whisper in Spanish. Well, maybe you should put on some more music. It is nice. This is this is from Octopath Traveler. Anyway, before I get rambling and waste a bunch of time up the stream, I'm gonna go stretch. I'll be back. I hope you guys appreciate my very 
uh, amateur fade outs there. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, I have stretched. I have gotten another beer. We're ready to go. It's gamer time. If Rabbids weren't in the game, I'd play it. Oh man, I feel that so goddamn hard. The only bad thing about that game is the fact that there are Rabbids in it. Glad to see some healthy chat going on in the chat. <coughs> Please excuse me, my throat has been very dry today. I think I might be coming down with something. I hope not, but... Also doesn't help that I am currently trying to quit smoking. Working on it. I don't like to talk about it too much. The rabbits are other dirty Xenos. What's bad about rabbits? Italian XCOM. I hope I'm not getting sick either, Fallen. I'm gonna have to go back and see some of these things. There's a few things I wanted to comment on. Let's see. Start a break. Dev on them haters, poggers in the chat. One day I'll be able to say stuff like that and I'll get a spam of poggers going on. If you go back and watch the end of uh, Metal Gear Rising Revengeance, you'll see me just just like yelling at Re when I was finally about to finish the boss fight like spam Frank or Z's in the chat I know you don't know anything about Twitch but just find the emote and spam it I, I just I need the support never played Fortnite or Battle Royale me, me either Fallen Minecraft is cool but I haven't played Minecraft in a long time favorites are XCOM, Doom 1 and 2 Doom is definitely good. I like the uh, I like the remake of Doom. It's been good. I might play that sometime. Want to try Persona 5, but no console for that. If you got a PS3, I was actually surprised to find out that it's on PS3 as well. But that's what Re and I played it on. Minecraft is neat, but I only play creative mode. I prefer survival mode. I prefer survival mode. I get very bored very quickly of creative mode. Minecraft with friends. And Do I need to know the stories of the previous Persona games? No, they are all independent. You don't you do not know to need to know anything about any of the other Persona games. If anything, going into Persona 5 blind without knowing anything about the other games is probably a good thing just for like one plot point but you know I won't I won't spoil it for you rabbits went in the game I play rabbits are dirty xenos what's bad about rabbits they're, they're like minions they came before minions but they were yeah Italian XCOM. I do not know what languages XCOM comes in. I don't know if Nintendo's been very good about different languages in their first party games these days. Okay, carry yourself? Oh yeah. <laughs> Look, I haven't got much else to do these days except take care of myself, so don't worry about me, Colin. Oh wait, no, that was John that said that. Colin said I can't watch too much lag so I'm going, oh, I'm sorry to, try, sorry to hear that Colin, but hopefully your internet sorts itself out over time. I was very confused, I was, but I spammed Frank or Z as instructed. Spoiler for his persona, it's a Japanese game. I want to see that moment. 
It's a. Uh, you won't see the uh, the chat, but it's it's on YouTube in the archive. Ah, you just missed her. The ritual is over. She left with my men to an island. What? I think it's time I paid my due respects towards your impressive and stubborn will. Mr. Kennedy, welcome. Uh, the VOD is still on Twitch, yeah. I have Twitch Prime, so it saves my VODs for 60 days. Save you some time. I think uh, there's a highlight video of me fighting the last boss of that game. You can just watch that. That has the chat Monsters. in it as well. Yes, after this, there'll be one less to worry about. Die, monster! You don't belong in this world. Dodge. Did it now. Oh. Backflip. Damn it. I'm having a hard time hitting this eye. Nice fallen. It's rumored that uh, that Super Nintendo games might be coming to Switch soon for their online service. Which would be real cool because I don't really have a way of playing a whole lot of Super Nintendo games. And there are a lot of Super Nintendo games that I would like to play. I heard that from Switch Force. Yeah, I think uh, data binders managed to. Uh, not sure what to think about that. Data miners found it in the uh, the NES stream service thing. Oh no, I'm not. Uh, I'm not interested in emulators. If I'm gonna do it on stream, it's gonna be like legal copies. There, sir.
Okay, so we got three healing items. We're not too bad. It's a very expensive service. It is not very expensive here. It's like five bucks a month, so... Piece of shit. Sorry, not you. I just... For context, Fallen, I just shot Salazar in the head as I said that. I know my place. Is this the final boss? I don't think so. In fact, I happen to know that this is not the final boss. Forget this game. No, it's just Salazar, so... Is that it? Are we done here? I think we're done here. Sweet. I'll take like three of those over an El Gigante any day. Reclaim my last name from that bass, dude. I didn't know you had such a personal connection to him, Fallen. But it's been done. Honor has been restored to your name. But no, I think there's still at least two more chapters to this game. I'm Salazar IRL. I'm sure that didn't have any influence as to you, as to whether or not you enjoyed this game at all, in the slightest. I have a fancy name and a fancy last name, ooh. My names are Irish, so... Not very fancy, hence, hence the beer I'm currently drinking. Is it Fancy Salazar? I enjoyed killing him. I bet you did. Got some rare things on sale, stranger. Supposed to say no, fancy's my middle name. What are you buying? Is that all? <laughs> Thank you. What are you selling? Do I have anything worth selling? Let's see. I got 17 of these. <laughs> Thank you. Is that all? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Last opportunity of a great joke. Well, you can hang on to that one for next time. You can keep that one for free. Oh. I think I have enough to make one of these these treasures. I could make a couple, actually. Let's see. Fine. Green. That's all of them. Fine. Blue. 
combine red, combine green. Cannibal Ninja 1990. Do you have a favorite weapon yet? Um, this is my first playthrough, so right now, uh, let's see, where where's my regular item screen? So I've been using the Red Nine. That's been that's been holding me over quite a bit, and then the riot gun's been also as well, and then the the uh, the semi-auto rifles kind of rounded out the uh, the long long range. Nicholas Ernesto Bernal Salazar. That does sound pretty fancy. And I haven't actually used the broken butterfly, I've just been hanging on to it because a couple people told me that it was worth hanging on to. But yeah, Red 9 is definitely, definitely up there, Cannibal. Um, what was... oh yeah. I was what selling things. Selling? Oh, we got a couple of these. <laughs> Thank you. What are you buying? Is <laughs> Is <laughs> Thank oh. you. Increases the firepower beyond the weapon's threshold. Is that all strike? <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, welcome to the stream, Cannibal. Hope you're having a good day. We've just been having a bit of a lazy Sunday today. Couldn't really decide what to play, so I ended up just continuing this game. It's uh, our fifth game for game clearing, which is just small initiative that I have to beat as many games that I haven't played before as possible. And so far Resi 4 has been interesting. I can see why a lot of people are very attached to this game, but... Oh, this is backwards. But it definitely also feels a little dated. Just a tiny bit. Around here, most everyone has a name that long. See, I'm a Newfoundlander, and I bet, like, got some rare things on sale, stranger. I can't think of anybody in Newfoundland who would ever think that, like. Like, if you had more than two names, like, you know, that's too much effort, man. Like, get rid of them. But Newfoundlanders are just Need a ride, handsome? generally lazy when it comes to language. Okay. End of chapter four. All right, chapter five, incoming. Now uh, we're talking about IRL now, Norn. Why don't you wear some proper clothes for something like this? Come on. Women. I don't know if that's a women thing, Leon. I hate to break it out to you, but Salazar's dead. Yes, it seems that way. Sadler, why don't you give up and let Ashley go home? Perhaps you are disillusioned with overconfidence. Just because you killed my small-time subordinate. Sadler, you're small-time. Oh. <laughs> Rive in my cage of torment, my friend. No, you! G 
good comeback, Leon. Good comeback. <coughs> the joke is that Ada's always doing th things like that, yeah? I understand that, but I'm still gonna give her a hard time about it. Like, really. I've seen bits and pieces of Resident Evil 6. I know it is kind of weird. I know she can't be trusted. Okay. Yeah, like... Other than, you know, playing this far in this game, the only other experience I have with the Resident Evil franchise is watching Let's Plays of 5 and 6. And they're not exactly the greatest example of Resident Evil games. Though, so, I mean, they inspired me to play this, so... I guess there's that. This area is not easy to navigate. So let's see, I think we already went up here. Yeah, we broke those boxes. The bridge we didn't do, okay. The Red Nine is a beast, definitely a pistol guy myself, yeah. I just, you know, spent all my money to finish upgrading this thing and we're gonna see how how much of a difference that, that's made. Oh great. I was starting to get comfortable without her. This guy is looking a lot more zombie than the rest of these people have. For a second there, it looked like his his brain worm had some extra ooh, extra eyeballs on it. Uh oh. What if I just do this? Oh. He does have a melee attack that's not... Not a viable option. Oh. Oof. That is... Come on, she lamps. Cannibal Ninja 1990, thank you for the follow, dude. Much appreciated. If you're into, uh. If you're into watching people do blind playthroughs of games, you're in the right place. Because you're gonna get a lot of shit like that. I don't think that egg healed me as much as I thought it did. That... And that gun probably does a lot more damage than... than I thought it would. Do I have... Yeah, plenty of grenades. Maybe I should use some of those.
Well, he's not dead, but I can only assume that did a lot of damage. No more hat for you. Ow. Come on. Safe up here. No. See, I was hoping this would just be like, you know, flip a couple switches, open the door, but it looks like this might be a puzzle, so. Oh, uh oh. Excuse me. Excuse me, sir. I don't. I don't appreciate you coming into my space. This was supposed to be my safe space. Right, okay, I can jump down here. Still getting out. If you're interested in dumb shit in this game, there's a way to wear a fedora with Leon and make Ashley wear armor. Ow. Oh. Should have paid more attention to my health there. Well, that certainly sounds interesting, Fallen. Maybe we'll do it this way. Sit down. It'll unlock when you finish the game, yeah. Don't worry, we won't, uh... I know like most of the games that we've played on stream, we've like finished as soon as we, you know, finish the game, but that doesn't mean I'm not open to still playing it after we hit the credits. I will definitely do some bonus streams of this one. Can he even hit me through this wall? Doesn't seem like it. That was much more effective. Got X there, but ow. Yeah, he's gonna grow ahead there. It's time to bust out some of these grenades. I got. Okay, good. He's dead. Moving on. Bam. 
All right. Ringo Starr, how's it going? Didn't know we had a. Uh, didn't know we had some professional musicians there in our stream here. I'd like to pretend that Ringo is just, you know, taking a break in the studio, just hanging out. And he just, you know, comes across Twitch and he's like, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna check out some of my favorite games here. Resident Evil 4, that sounds like a great time. I don't really know what Ringo Starr sounds like, to be quite honest, but... I know he's British. How are you? I'm doing pretty good. How are you, Ringo? He honors us with his presence. Okay. Looks like a sensor. Okay, so I gotta rotate these so that it goes to that thing, I guess. See, the music's still going, so I'm concerned that there's still enemies hanging out somewhere. reload. There's music, there should be enemies. I, I'm sorry to say Fallen, but we solved the puzzle in the music step. I don't think there's any more enemies. Unless somebody's manning the spotlight. In which case, can only assume he's harmless. But yeah, I do agree with you, Fallen. That is probably one of the few times in this game that that has actually happened. Bro, really? Who just drops rocks on people? conventions. They should all be exactly the same. 100%. Egg. Oh, 
How important are eggs to you in your Minecraft quest, Fallen? Or not Fallen, Colin. I gotta keep doing that. Like, you guys give me as much shit as possible whenever I do that. But yeah, like, what? Colin, once you get 64 stacks of bread, are you gonna aim for 64 stacks of eggs or something? Are eggs important to you at all? It's very lag, so I don't know what is happening. Weird. Like... Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna try lowering the bit rate. Oh, I can't do that without taking down the stream. The sound of silence. Hello darkness, my old friend. I've come to talk with you again. Um, I don't know. It seems to be seems to be going fine for me. Like. I really just understood Minecraft and 64 stacks. Uh, Twitch starts to buffer. I Me, mean, it's going fine too. Glad to hear that, Fallen. I think Ree might be getting ready for bed, but I might ask her to monitor the stream for a quick minute. Tell me if it's being choppy or something. Salazar! Oh, don't worry. We took care of Salazar. Sadler's up next. We just need to... We just need to figure out where we're going first. Ooh, a chest. I like chests. Of 
course I need you, Fallen. I wouldn't be able to, uh... I wouldn't be able to do anything without you. I need you here beside me. I need to know that your your loving ears are are tuning in here. That guy just like lied down. He was like, oh god. Shot once and he just gave up. I see you singing to yourself. That's good. Right. I like chess. Twist twitch starts to buffer. They're trying to censor me, man. Don't listen to him. Don't believe Twitch's lies. Show him the ways of the Spanish knife. Stream just oofed. It's so hard to like. Like, I haven't had to troubleshoot internet settings at all, really. Spanish knife is a legendary technique that can, but only that can be used for many things. Like, defend yourself or make some breakfast. You can also use it to interrogate people and impregnate women with your seed. There are many mysteries to the, to the Spanish knife. But yeah, like I haven't had a problem streaming something in 10, like, 1080p 60 frames per second in a long time. The magic of the Spanish knife. What are you buying? So, like, I don't even know what to tell people, like... Thank you. Come back anytime. Just, you know... Lower your settings. Can't do that, because... God knows we're never gonna get that option on our channel. I really hope Ree didn't go to bed without saying anything. I doubt she would, but it's slightly after nine o'clock. Not yet, okay. I wasn't even sure if you were still here. I thought you might have even turned your computer off at this point. Turn on low latency. That's definitely an option. Excuse me, gentlemen. I may turn low latency back on uh, next stream.
Well, I'll see how an extreme goes, and if it's not, uh, still gives us problems, then I might turn low latency back on. Or off. I understand how low latency works, it just... Every time I try and say it... Gotta be locked from the other side. Every time I try and say it, it's like the opposite way around for me. Yep, she's got to work in the morning, so she'll be... She'll be leaving us early. Oh. But that's fine, since I trust you guys, and... The F screen. Yep, yep, we died. It was a terrible inconvenience. Ooh, ten chocolate shells. This meat's rotten. But I sure could you go use a fat, juicy steak right now. Damn it, Leon. We don't have time for that shit. I'm going to fall asleep. If you gotta go, Colin, you gotta go. Don't worry about me, man. You got some rest, dude. You're very tall. But apparently being tall doesn't protect you from shotguns. Convenient. Amateurs. Just hang in there, Ashley. I'm coming for you. So if something being tall makes you, you even more vulnerable to shotguns, I don't think being tall has anything to do with it. Hell is that sound? Okay, I'm just gonna run and say goodnight to Riri real quick. You have your ma more mass, so you're more easy to hit. And I guess that's... can't argue with that one. Excuse me. Well, I stood up, and I suddenly had to go to the bathroom, so... Just to update you, I'm gonna go to the bathroom real quick. I'll be back.
very useful information. I just figured I'd let you know. You know. In case you're wondering why it disappeared for for an extended period of time. We are out of uh out of healing items. Hopefully this flash grenade will help us. Uh oh. Flash grenade did not help us. So is that it? They just throw twice? Come on. Why are there three of them? What the hell? Can I go through this door now? Okay, good. Hang on to that. Better be using it right away. Just in case. There we go. Much better. Brass pocket watch. Hashtag buff boys. Chris F. Boulders Redfield. <laughs> Sounds like a... Something Spanish something. Yeah, welcome. Welcome, Chris Redfield. You, uh... Have a good time punching boulders recently? Oh. Chris, thank you for the follow. It's much appreciated. Also, I pause some, some strange noises coming from my neighbors. Really hope that's not getting picked up by the mic because that is. Weird noises indeed. It's more of a part time job for me now. You just get contracted out every now and again to go and punch some boulders. Send some, uh. Send some incredibly mutated individuals into volcanoes. key card to get through that. Also locked. Hmm. Stupid door. I'm 
kind of research equipment. I wonder what it's used for. Probably that. Whatever that is. Looks like they were conducting some sort of autopsy. Bet they were researching. And the companies think they're saving money by not buying heavy machinery and they're not saving that much money by hiring me. I can't imagine how much money it costs to hire Chris Redfield to punch a boulder. It's locked. Must be the door's security system. Operate. Turn which color panel? Uh, blue. Okay. Green. And red. Hacker man. Lewis's memo three. A lot indeed. Hideous creatures such as El Gigante and the Nova Stators are merely byproducts of the bi diabolical in inhumane experiments conducted by on the specimens that were once human. But there's one type of creature that clearly distinguishes itself from the rest. These creatures are called regenerators. Regenerators have a superior metabolism that allows them to regenerate their lost body parts at an incredible speeds. I've never seen anything like it. If it it is this characteristic that makes them almost invincible to conventional weapons. But like any living creature, there's a way to kill it. Apparently, there are plagas that live in its body. Somewhat like leeches. They can't be seen with the naked eye. They can only be located through thermal imaging. To stop its regeneration process, these leech-like plagas must be located and then destroyed. As far as I know, most of the regenerators host a number of these leech-like plagas. To kill the regenerators, each one must, each one of these leech-like plagas must be killed. Is that? These pictures aren't very helpful. I can't really tell what's going on. What the? Some kind of experiments are going on around here. Weird. Is that it? Is that everything that's in here? Oh no, we got a key card. Freezer key card. Convenient information indeed. Hello friend. Did that mean something? That means that we're in the presence of regenerators now. Excuse me, sir. Uh-oh. Please don't bite me. I hate these things. Yeah, I've... I have not heard very good things about them. Excuse me. Twitchy freak. Oh, he was on the table. Right, right. smart and know that I just need to leave here. I will do that. 
Sounds good, Fallen. We'll be here. This door. Oh, this is just this is back. I don't want to go back. I mean, I don't really want to be here either, but. I don't have very many choices. Insert freezer keycard. Oh. Uh oh. Bodies must have been cryogenized with the parasites still in their bodies. Sucks to be them. Yeah, fuck those guys. Big smiles. Big, happy smiles. Sounds like a convenient device to have. And just change your access manually. Doesn't really matter. You can get into wherever you want with this card. Infrared scope. Excuse me. Smiley's decided he doesn't want to be frozen no more. Uh oh. No. Excuse me. Donald Bay Trump is thick. When are you gonna do a face reveal? My face is on screen. I don't know what you're talking about, Mr. Trump, sir. Dumb. I can't say no to requests of people that I know. I'm very good at saying no. Can't see you, I'm deaf. Sounds about right. I'm deaf, but for my eyes. Oh, this is slightly fun.
Don't worry, President Trump, I'm doing this for you. I don't know, it's not really... It's more so that I have the opposite problem and that, like, I never really say yes to things. I get really anxious and then, like, I just say no, but at the same time, it's like... I understand that saying yes all the time can also be a problem. Some people learn to rely on you and people... It's a waste of Maybe it leads to the lower levels? I don't know, Leon. Maybe you should jump down there. Jump on down there with all the Mexicans we just deported. Practice? Yeah, practice, definitely. Just getting used to, like, being able to say, hey, like, you know, you don't need to give people excuses to, uh, to say no to them. And if they're the kind of people that are going to give you a hard time about it, then, you know. Oh, great. Oh, well, they spotted me. That worked out pretty well. Just leave. Oh, come on, really? They respawned. Maybe I should keep that equipped. So apparently tomorrow I have something to do that, that's something kind of good for my anxiety. That's good to hear. I need a key card for this too. Son of a I guess we're going back. Sorry, Ashley. Yeah, that's the real question, is like, you know, where is this... Where is this good thing for your anxiety coming from? It makes me think of something and feel useful, but the person that I accept to help is kind of a dick. Oh, yeah. Really, uh, really puts you on the fence there, doesn't, doesn't it? Helping people out is one thing, but helping out shitty people is a whole other thing entirely. Look at these lab instruments. They're like Uh oh.
sir, sir, I need, I need your badge. Yeah, I don't know what it, what it would be like to try and uh, volunteer where you are. Yeah, transportation can be another big thing as well, eh, Fallen? Ow. sure what I'm supposed to do about this this thing I just no it doesn't look like I have to I was thinking I had to like go up to it while it was stunned and just grab it not sure It's good to hear, Colin. Damn it, Leon. Fucking move already.
See, I didn't think I was going to be able to kill him that easily. I just kind of assumed that I wasn't able to do so. Guess I was wrong. Oh, just uh, killing our first regenerator. I mean, Colin's been in and out, so... Oh, help, right. No, it's still very laggy. Hmm. This is Leon. Request backup. I repeat, request backup. You ain't getting no backup, buddy. Is that all we came up here for? Looks like it. Backup to dot exe does not respond. Would you like to send an error report to Windows? Windows is uninstalling. You're right, Fallen. The most detrimental thing that you can do to your Windows computer is download Windows. Welcome! Got a selection of good things on sale, stranger. What are you buying? Tactical vest. What are you selling? Selling enough money for enables you to see the hidden parasites in enemies' bodies. Ooh. 
Is that all? <laughs> Thank you. Come back. Selling. Ah, <laughs> thank you. Is that all? <laughs> thank you. Is that all? <laughs> Is that all, stranger? Is that all? <laughs> thank you. Is that all? <laughs> thank you. Yo. What are you buying? Is well, that's that enough for the tactical <laughs> vest. You. There, that should make things a lot easier going forward. Seriously, like, what am I missing here? Like, is that it? Is this just a dead end? Maybe. I'm not sure, like... You know, I walk down the path and... I mean, I guess it is. We got the key card. <laughs> Two dead ends. Did one of them involve a communications tower? Ow. Uh. 
I was supposed to be rescuing Ashley. I don't even remember where she is. Oh yeah, she was down this way. Ow. Okay, Ashley was in here. She's not in here anymore. Oh, she's here. You okay? Come on, let's get out of here. End of chapter five dash one. Don't, for, don't worry, Fallen. She was there, yeah. Don't worry. You'll be spared of Ashley for tonight, but I think the next time we come back to this game, we're gonna be... We're gonna be plagued by... By the Ashley menace. That was fine. Certainly started to pick up a little bit more closer to the end. I was very tired at the beginning of the stream, but I'm feeling a lot better now. And, uh, and we didn't do too bad. We got three new followers today, leaving us at, let me just double check the number here, 29. Wow. We're, we're making progress, guys. We're getting somewhere. But, uh... What with that? So this sounds like the end of the stream. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh... This is the end. Ending off about ten minutes early. There you go. Yep, it's gamer time. But yeah, I hope you guys have a good night. Um, we'll be back... I guess tomorrow's day off, so we'll be back... on Tuesday. With, uh... With something. Glad to be here. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> yes, you too, Fallen, and same to you, Norn. Good to have you two here. You guys have excellent nights, and I'll see you guys in a couple days. Have a good one. <laughs>